again. That that can't be a, a premonition because Mishima was. We've had to play this game before then. Did I just have some kind of dream? I don't know what the cru Maybe it was a hallucination? Uh, this place. Yeah, we're doing it again. Yo, you gonna eat that? I'm stinking. Oh, God, she has only had one sip of water for three days! I. Everyone, how are you feeling? I'm freaking hungry! I, I truly thank you for once again participating in the main game. Like I got a choice, what the... I will omit detailed explanations, but I have one point of warning this time. It appears one of you lost your tablet. Due to the need for fingerprint identification, others cannot misuse it, but as it's in a disadvantage to not know your own role, a spare tablet has been placed on your table. Please use it if you are the person in question. Uh... That is all for my warning. To proceed with the rules, please touch the screen. It's starting a second main game. Ugh, I'm not prepared! I got all this useless bullcrap in my- Uh We still don't know what the crap this is. Who is- <sighs> Shin Sumiki Hinaka. Gin, we know. Kana is there. <sighs> this is definitely gonna come up. Now we got the deal with the stun gun. Where did where did Kutara even get that? And why was Kutara putting the guards down? Whatever. I got no choice but to go forward. Well then, allow me to explain the rules of the main game. We already know all that though. The basic rules are that one person to be sacrificed will be chosen by majority vote. The vote will be split into two parts. Through the first round, the preliminary vote, half the total will be chosen as candidates. As there are eight present alive, this would be four. A final vote will be held using these deciding the ultimate victim. In other words, the sacrifice is decided by narrowing down eight to four to one. It's awful to think this way, but in theory, now finding the sacrifice is technically easier, in a way, of importance are the four roles, which you literally already know why am I explaining this again. Incidentally, in the event that multiple people are tied for fr What? If the sacrifice is in the tie, the sacrifice wins. If the key master is the tie, all shall perish. Uh, uh, there are new rules, what? If both the sacrifice and key master are tied for first, the key master takes priority. And all pet WHAT?! The distribution is one key master, sage, and sacrifice. All others are commoners. Best of luck. And may you avoid total destruction at all costs. That goes without saying. Come, come on. There's no rules?! I guess there's never been an even amount of survivors before. Well, everyone. Please wait for the main game to be- uh, Huh? Uh, huh?! Hey, got you! Miley! What? Huh? Got you! Are you listening? You've really gone and mucked things up! Watch, watch your profanity, lady! You've made a flagrant transgression! One that shakes the very core of the main game! Are you trying to appropriate the main game for your s- <laughs> What? Apologies for the video malfunction. Your display might have looked unsightly there for a moment. <laughs> The main game will now begin. Please enter, everyone. I gotta pee. Can I have a pee break? What the crud just happened? I don't know. Uh. Well, there's no nothing left to do. Except just get to it. We have already opened. Please enter quickly. Oh, freak. Oh, my bad. My bad. Ah. Here we go. The room with the giant toilets. Before me are strange, disgusting looking toilets. And Keiji. Ugh, he's so hot. Hey, you're here. You're early, KG. What was that earlier, Meow? Uh. Gosh, what's going on? Explain yourself! Kinda feels like this won't be a normal main game. What? It's starting all over again. I just. Uh. Uh. It's become a catchphrase as of. Oh my, what a bustling crowd. Did you call for me? Uh, yes. You! What's this transgression Miley mentioned, huh? Transgression? 
I'm afraid I do not know what you mean. I understand that if there truly is a transgression, it should become clear in your discussion. What? Supposing one is discovered, it will be addressed. You're right, a-hole. It's you who's gonna decide what counts as a transgression, ain't it? Yeah, she's got a point. We should, yeah, we should call for a mediator. Uh, Miley, you get in here so we can cause discourse and maybe escape. At least call Miley in so she can hand down a judgment on any misconduct, yeah. Miley is the floor master for floors one and two. I cannot do that. Then call in Safalin. Frick. Very well. If that will satisfy you. <laughs> okay. Hey, buddy, it's me. I'm here. I'm seriously here. Ser Please, be our uh, impartial judge, if you don't mind. <laughs> Wait, what kind of laugh is that? Bwahahaha. Bwahahaha. It just sounds... <laughs> it sounds stupid. I what are you laughing at, a-hole? Why is all this text on the screen? I am joyful. Such determination to have a fair slaughter without having to worry over misconduct. You god dang. Now then, let the second main game. Uh. Hang on! Uh, oh, yes. Yeah, <laughs> Sorry, what's wrong with your voice? Hey, oh my god. Oh, give me a second. Oh, we're fine. Oh, very good. Everyone has assembled. Uh, dang it! So we're starting after all, huh? Indeed. We have talked long enough. Now we shall begin the second main game! Finally, I'm stopping being interrupted. Okay, I need to focus. What's up with all these freaking gears, huh? I guess that's to look a little bit different for the second one. God, we lost so many effing people. <laughs> okay, let's focus. I don't even know what's gonna come up, but here we go. Extremely air... heavy air dominates the space. It's starting again, this horrifying game. Keeping quiet's only gonna make time pass, guys. Let's at least decide our fate by our own hand, okay? <laughs> okay. It's okay. We walked this road before, haven't we? Then and now it's totally different. We're allies by now! We spent way more time together. Then will you die? <laughs> Let's find our resolve. You said that in the first main game, right, Kutaro? Maybe I did, maybe I don't. It was a while ago. Dang it! Everyone, the card designs have been displayed in the rulebook this time. Oh, thank God. So be aware that you cannot judge using knowledge of the designs. As in the first main game. Well then, please spend this cruel and dense time to your heart's content. Also, I am here. <sighs> Gosh, you quietly sat down in a chair. And once again, the main game began. <laughs> okay, I'm good. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. First, let's dis uh, first let's discuss to get four candidates. Who should survive and who should die? Okay, sounds good to me. Okay, dokie. Seems you're ready. <laughs> Hold up, KG. Unlike last time, there's a bunch of card trades. If we logic it out, I'm sure we can figure out who has the sacrifice and keymaster. Without going around suspecting each other, I don't think that will work. Yeah, if everyone speaks honestly. Would they lie? Of course they would! At the very least, the sacrifice can't tell the truth. Now can they? So it's fine to start with finding four candidates. Uh-huh. Because those who aren't candidates can't be honest. Yep. And also, if we prove what everyone's cards are right now... Voting's gonna be hell. <clears throat> It'll be a pure blame throwing. That guy should die, this guy should die, you know. It'll be cruel. I'll leave no trace of any bonds we've got. Fine, I get it. I'm on board, KG. And so I'm gonna say it. So, you're the most suspicious in my book. Uh, huh? Wait a minute, Reiko! So contributed to our escape that didn't work. Oh, wait, I just said. I know that, but. And then who do I vote for? Uh. Well. I can't possibly choose anybody else. If I'm gonna vote, it's gonna be for so. 
This is how I, I really feel, okay? So, get a grip. Be honest and clear our doubts. Seems I just don't click with people who speak from emotion. Shut up! I'm telling you. Say what you really... And I'm fine being the first candidate. Oh my god, no. He has the card. He swapped with me. Right? I, we only heard... Oh god. I don't know. What? Huh? After all, I... What the crap? Huh? What the crap is going on? Am the sacrifice. Uh, what? Hey, were you even listening to us? This ain't the time to say your role. What? He's just... He can't be real. Was there a rule against confessing your own? I don't remember hearing that, actually. So I see. Sorry, KG. I just didn't feel comfy letting you take the initiative. I'm scared! Oh my god! I know! I'll nominate the next suspicious person. How about that? Oh my god, I'm dead, I'm dead! No, 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 you shouldn't do that! Y you can't! An approach where whoever's chosen nominates the next person is just... Huh? Are you panicking, Miss Sarah? <laughs> I'm not panicking! I'm as confident as ever! Yeah! I nominate Kana. Oh! What? Why? Now what are you saying? Everyone should already understand this. She is easily tricked. Timid. And lacks ability. What does she even have besides sympathy? You you are such a douche. Oh my Shut the hell up! Ain't it you who used her? Yeah, but also no, but also yes. After Using her so cruelly is so trying to betray her. So, you're giving Kana time to vindicate herself, huh? Huh? Sure thing. Let's have a discussion about Kana's actions during the main game. Or the death game. Yeah. So, that we can trust her. Okay, good deflection, KG. I like it. Uh, K Kana, at first, she just holed up in So's room, yeah? They're generally acted together. So should be the one who can prove her worth. Dang it! Let's see. Kana was dead weight the whole time. What a hindrance. <laughs> uh, hindrance? Hmm. Kana looks like she's pretty shocked to hear that. I, I couldn't blame her. Come on. Your only ally, and he's acting like this. I mean, is anyone surprised? I, I am surprised. What is going on? I'm sure you can understand, Sarah. You can extract statements from them. Statement? And also, we got a new weapon, too. Thank God, I, I found the gun! <laughs> Did I so? No, not really. I mean, if he died, then we would all, uh... You know, from when we were searching together, your shrewd detective vision? Uh, yeah, I can remember. When someone makes a statement, you might notice someone else having a reaction. Oh, snap, that's cool. I can do that? Whoa, thank you, walking tutorial! Let's get to it, partner. <laughs> okay, um... <clears throat> fangirling over. Let's- I'm a boy- anyway, so... Uh, what? That's creepy. Kana was dead weight the whole time. What a hindrance. Is that really- uh, I've been getting fed up with having a useless helper, too. Just now, I feel like So's first statement caused an expression to change. Yeah, with Kana. Well, their expression changed, I should check on them. Okay, Kana, do not worry. We will defeat him somehow. I don't- uh, Kana isn't a hindrance. Kana. Th that's it! What? Okay. Uh, they're generally acted together, so should know. Yeah, yeah. And yet, so's abandoned her. What a POS. If I just had some material to counter with, I'd have got nothing. At first, she sold him in the room. Though, so, later in the trading phase, she did seem like she was acting alone. Is that true? Well, though said latter half. I was knocked out, so I hardly got a clue. In that case, I can't rely on him. Can we really ever? Um... I don't... I don't know. Endurance. This isn't... This isn't giving us anything. I don't even know where to go. Come on. Uh... This, maybe? No... What? <sighs> that... That... What?! That's what I was supposed to do?! I gotta click on her face. Oh. I'm not mad, but.
but that did take me 10 minutes to figure out. Okay, Kana, are, are you too shocked to speak? But it seems like she's trying to say something. In that case, uh, I just have to inspire Kana. So Undertale mode, go! Okay, cool, cool, cool. What is, what, is this all part of So's plan? It's such bullcrap, because we, oh crap, it's harder than I thought. It's not that bad, though, but. Her and Kutara were talking to So for the entire chapter. And they're super close, but I, but I can't deny it. What did Kana do on her own? Not a lot, but I can't. Kana, are you fine with him just saying that? That, beat him up, beat him up, Kana. You can do it, girl, get. It's, it's fine, you can get mad. Let what's in your heart come right out. Kana, Kana. She isn't a hindrance at all! So saying mean things just because he can do hacking and stuff, but... Wasn't Kana the one who did hacking f What? Huh? Yeah, that's right, you're not a computer hacker! You work in a convenience store, you douche! What? She's a computer hacker? Uh, did I say something bad? No, no, you did <sighs> Yeah, hold your horses! How'd you mean that? Uh, um... Kana did hack? <laughs> Such a... out of nowhere. Sheesh. You never make yourself clear. Please tell us about this in a little more detail, yeah! Okay! Thank God. Okay, we're moving. Whew! Kana did some hacking way before So did any of his hacking. Uh, what kind of hacking was it? I figured out password. Breaking into someone else's things, that's called hacking, right? Uh, maybe? Does it mean is a dead with computers too? Oh my god! You can't call something like that hacking. Don't misuse words you only just learned. What the? Mm. She is a very intelligent middle schooler, okay? Alright, Sarah. Let's advance the discussion like this. E yeah. Extract statements to expand. Okay, thank god. We got this back, too. How statements duke it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And this time, unlike the final attraction, there's no time limit. Okay, we'll start with now, because she's adorable. This is me and Connors that with computers. I heard they taught programming to middle schoolers, but I think they even teach hacking? Holy frick! I'm pretty sure they do not teach that in school. But what password could it have been? When I heard that, I could only think of the password to start the laptop. Hmm... So did So lie about finding the password himself? I figured out the password, that's hacking, right? So had been fretting about it since yesterday. He was going, I don't know the password! Ugh. Taking his beanie off and putting it on and again and taking it off and wearing it like pants and... But suddenly I looked at So's hand. He was struck by how clean he kept them, even in these circumstances. What? <laughs> That's a really weird detail to notice, Kana. Uh, and then I had an epiphany. That there might be traces from the password being typed. So I figured out the password from finger marks left on the key. Holy frick, you're a genius! Huh? I extracted a new statement. Neato. Well, let's, we'll hear what he has to say first, and then first is that. You can't call that hacking. It's really concerning. We don't have much time for discussion. And how about you explain everything about yourself, so, well, you know... <laughs> I am explaining. Explaining what a useless girl Kana is. Don't talk about people like tools. Yeah, it's over. We'll verse your statement. No, no, no. Store here. Yeah. And then, apply? This might be wrong. I mean, it has to be either this or now, but I imagine it's here. Arguing now won't prove anything. <laughs> My clout be gone! I guess the only other option we have is, uh, to apply it to what now says, right? Yes, thank god. Uh, Kana? Could it be you didn't use the laptop to hack? Uh, but rather you solved the password from the laptop itself? Yeah. Is that not hacking? Uh, so why is the laptop so glowy? I see. Before the laptop was handed to So, it was the last- I was the last one to enter the password. And my finger- Prince left marks. Little bits of dirt when I press the keys. Okay. When did you solve the password, Kana? It was 
was before the training thing. Uh, hold on a sec. Don't you think that sounds funny, Sarah? Does it? I don't follow. I mean, so shared the laptop with us. So we could learn the password, did it? Yeah, you're right. But according to you, you peeked inside before sharing the laptop with everybody. Uh, yeah, what about it, big boy? <laughs> There's no reason to join forces? That's wrong. So wanted an opportunity to reconcile. Kana, sorry to say, there was another reason. Uh. Why did So share the laptop with us? Uh, to view the Sarah folder? Uh. He awakened to goodness! <laughs> no. Uh, he wanted to be friends. He wanted to gain our trust. Like Kana says, So wanted to be friends. Calm down, Sarah. He ain't that kind of guy. But no, like, he wanted to gain friends to fake it? So, you were trying to look inside the Sarah photo on the laptop, weren't you? Oh my god, I'm dumb. That's true, that did have a password. The Sarah folder had a separate password. Which had the name of Sarah's mom. Oh, did it? I completely forgot that. It, you gotta be kidding! So, you accepted my deal without saying nothing about it? Your deal? <laughs> what of it? <laughs> Why, you... Hold on a sec, what, what kind of deal is this? <laughs> don't sweat it. It's just between us boys. I don't think so. I thought it was strange from the get-go. That seems there was a deal going on behind the sharing of the laptop. Come on, Qtaro, spill the beans. Please. I'll have you tell us everything about the suspicious deal. God, it's so cool. Thank God. Okay, uh, please. I, I, I went to so and asked him to share the laptop. What's wrong with that? You know, I was surprised. Qtaro said he'd give me his tokens in exchange, but I don't think he do. I don't think he might have done that. The two talked to each other separated by So's bedroom. Kana heard it too. Okay, well then. I mean, I had a responsibility, you know? Huh? When the token gathering sub game started, I. Uh, I gathered more tokens than anybody to survive. Right, that checks out. Even the laptop I managed to get my hands on, I handed it over in exchange for So's tokens. So you could get 200 and escape. I was possessed by the need for tokens. Like Chuck E. Cheese gone wild. I, uh, back then, you know. I, uh, Is that really the only reason? Come on. You knew you only needed 100. That, obviously. You think so blackmailed me or something? That ain't it. Blackmails, they're really nothing. No, that's not true because, what's it called? Don't we have, no, we don't have, no, wait, we do have it. Uh. Shows our past actions. So witnessed Qtara placing the cards. He knew that. Dude, that's that's gotta be it, right? Also, how, oh, that's how we escape it. Alright. Oh, we need to extract. What did you what did you say? I didn't intend to hear him out. But Qtara was so serious, I couldn't just turn him down. And it turned out to be a good trade. Hmm. Don't give me that scary look, Sarah. You benefit from getting to see the laptop for free, right? True, but still, that doesn't... God, he's so... I don't know how you... He's smarter than me, okay? Obviously, but still... So said that's not a bad deal. And he also said maybe we'll reconcile. So Kana got really happy. Okay, Kana still believes in the goodness and so, but why? I guess just tons of... Not brainwashing, but is it gaslighting? Or... I mean, it could be that. The phone could be a, a indication of some gaslight. It's just manipulation, bro. God, maybe it's deeper. I don't know. Anyways, yeah, I'm pretty sure we gotta show this item to Qtaro. There was a reason for you and So to join forces, and here it is. Yeah. Oh frick! Ah, Qtaro, was there really no opportunity for blackmail? None at all. Uh, what you saying? <laughs> We acquired a certain video. Footage from the first floor security cameras. Uh, what? I didn't know there was 
even such a thing? It was clearly all pictured. You, playing Yu-Gi-Oh at the lunch table like a nerd. <laughs> I like Yu-Gi-Oh. Kutaro placing the roll cards. And so, seeing him do it. If this isn't blackmail material, what is? No way. Kutaro was the one who placed the cards? Muscle Gorilla was a traitor? A traitor. Is that really the case? Maybe not. We don't know, but we have to hear it from him. Was there other circumstances? Ironically, it's because of my improved intuition that I don't understand. What? How could someone like Kutaro be a traitor? Why'd you do a thing like that? Where'd you get the cards, Kutaro? Please say something! Anything! Security cameras, what you mean? What? Huh? We searched every inch of the first floor. Did anybody find any security cameras? Come on. Uh, 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 we found them! I... The footage is also proof. Come on. We, okay, we didn't literally find the cameras, but then how do you explain the footage? Whether we discovered any cameras isn't what's important. You were caught on camera. That's the only proof we need. Must be a puppet show. Whoa! Ah! He means with the dolls, crud. You think about it, being tricked left and right, you know? Fake Reiko, fake Mishima AI. Ah. Kidnappers can move around fakes of us whenever and however they like. You, le you legit can't argue against that. Unless so says he did it, and that wasn't the case. Crud! You mean... Looks like you got tricked, Sarah. I ain't never done nothing like that. Script by the kidnappers. Actors are fakes! You fell for the fake movie put on by dolls! Dang it! I don't know what you guys saw, but it was all a trap, I tell you. Learn your lesson. But come on! Talk about a disadvantage. Preparing fakes to trick us with a stellar move by our enemies, huh? You can't take Kutara lightly either. Yeah, he's... Something's going on with him. I don't know if this is So's influence or what, but what the frick? Looks like you've been talked down for once, Miss Sarah. Shut up! Anyway, I told you about the deal between me and So. I mean, after we all looked at the laptop, I was passed out the whole time. Gotta be somebody more suspicious than me. Come on. Uh. Double down, give up? No, I'm not giving up. Hold on. Why did you pass out in the room of rubble in the first place, Kutaro? Uh, well, if you, you think I needed a motive, that was an... I... I don't remember. No way. It's true. I, I got no memory from the moment I entered that room. I woke up, I was in the main game. Now that's a rude awakening. Is he... Who would want him to be silenced? So, but where was So during that event? Wasn't he the last one to enter the room? But no, he was in the... If I'm thinking about the lobby like it's an actual lobby, he couldn't get from the computer hacking room to the room of rubble. Or not the room of rubble, but you know. Yeah, yeah, that's the room of rubble. Without passing us, right? So it could have been him. Who's last to show up? I don't... Ugh. So surely someone else knocked him out, right? I don't know. Then we should find out who did it. They gotta be a villain, Wolf. Right. The last time I saw Kutara healthy wasn't when we were looking for the laptop. Or no, looking at the laptop. Then after the sacrifice was passed to me. Yeah. I started to panic and ran off to get tokens, so we didn't... Yeah, we didn't see. Now I remember exactly what happened. Right, I didn't see Kutaro after that, so it basically could have been anybody. I can't... if I can determine everyone's actions at that time. But we can't! We gotta use other people's testimony. Alright, then we gotta talk about what each of us was doing then. Oh god, Sarah looks kinda shady in this situation. God dang. When we shared the laptop, there were six of us in the lobby. It was me, 
It was so kinda Sarah, KG, and Reiko. Who ain't there? I don't even know. Gin? Friggin' Gin. God dang. After Sarah suddenly took off running, we stayed and looked at the laptop, but there wasn't much else on it. After we were done looking, Kana went to deliver the laptop to So. Your friendly policeman stayed in the lobby for a little while. I wasn't feeling well and ran to the bathroom. I talked with Miss Now on the way back. Of course you did. Yeah. Right, I talked with So about our plan to hack the profession Mishima AI, which we totally did, by the way. I was there. You were there. You saw it. I was searching the pitch black, uh, first floor, meow. Who's the one? Oh my god, there's so many people. Literally everybody has something to say. Always gotta go in order. From most suspicious to least. Uh, no, the opposite. Least suspicious. It's definitely Gen. I don't believe it. Why would he attack Kutaro? I mean, maybe he's mad about the final attraction, but still. I was thinking I'd go back to the third floor, but there is a nuisance in the way. Oof. Laughing doll, smiley! It was scary! <laughs> yeah, she is pretty ugly. I mean, so Gin was at the first floor until I reunited with him in the Room of Lies. I mean, that checks out. I don't know how we got there, but uh, what about you now? I talked with So about the plan. I think it was because the plan went well that our escape could progress. So it was really dependable then, and kinda hot, but then, uh... Then yeah, yeah, it didn't work, okay. If you organize it by rows, it's a lot easier, so I think I'll try that approach going forward, but, uh, what about Reiko? Huh? After we're done looking, we sort of split up. Went searching here and there. I don't have a the whole... but ad-lib or nothing. <laughs> Never read that before. But I ain't the culprit. Okay. A little shaky for Reiko. I'm just, like, trying to add them in my mind. What about you, KG? Did you see anything in the lobby? People came by the lobby now and then. So I can verify their alibis. Any other questions, cute little detective? Ah, I'm underage, KG, okay? You're being a little gr- He's kind of in high spirits. I think he's having a little too much fun. I don't like him like that. Uh, after you were done looking at it, Kana went to deliver the laptop. So is talking with now in the ruined corridor. About what? Sorry, Kana just gave So the laptop and left. She was worried about Sarah, so Kana wouldn't look around for her alone. Okay. Yeah, Kana, this is not looking good for you. Oh my god. What about Kutaro? After the sound of the trade and you leaving, Sarah, I, I went back searching, too. After talking to KG in the lobby, I, I went to the room of rubble. Then I lost consciousness, okay? I want to say I couldn't move all of a sudden and bump my head on the wall, but... Well, what? Okay, well, most suspicious is so. I wasn't feeling real and went to the bathroom. Specifically, we talked about our hacking plan. Kana came to deliver the laptop during our chat. I thought about having Kana join the plan, but she promptly went off somewhere. That's my alibi, pretty much. Pretty amazing. It could knock out Kutaro. Stun guns are dangerous stuff. That statement just now. What? What's weird about that statement? What does the stun gun say? It's dangerous, so Gin and I took it in secret. Yeah. What did this say verbatim? Shame is... It's a shame his precious time got wasted just like that. So, why do you know that? Yeah, we haven't talked to how about he got knocked out. So, you effed up. Wait, I just, I, so did I apparently. <laughs> this is it. How'd you know it was a stun gun? Only me and Gin were there. So, you know the weapon used well, so. Huh, crazy. How about that? Uh, huh? I quietly took the stun gun from the scene. So, only Gin and I knew that. Kutar was attacked with a stun gun. <laughs> the only person who could know is the culprit. So that settles it, huh? It was you who used the stun gun to knock out Kutaro. So... I give. You found me out so easily. <laughs> so, so, what a twist. Sorry. I didn't want anyone getting in the way. Not the hacking plan we were preparing. Uh, what? When we suddenly entered the room, I went and used it without even thinking. W where'd you find something dangerous like that? What the frick? Huh. Can't seem to recall. Sorry about that. Ah! Me meow? <laughs> Something's off. What the heck? I really have to be at your wit's end to use a single-use stun gun. I know. Is Qtar really that suspicious? Like, come on. 
I mean, I know he saw him put the cards down, so maybe So was thinking he was a part of he was a traitor. But is there something more going on between Kutaro and So? Well, obviously. Ugh. That's enough. Just knowing who the culprit was is enough. That that can't what might be pointless to push any further. So has got no intention of explaining himself. For now, we should spare time for someone else. If we're going to suspect each other, we have to do it now while we have time, huh? Even if it's hard to say, we have to say it. You mean doubting so we can trust? God, this game's confusing. That's right. Be brave and talk, everybody. Let's discuss. If there's anyone besides So who acted suspicious. Anyone who acted so I mean, now to an extent, but she had good reason, right? Come to think of it, I was wondering about how Now spent most of the first half in the Room of Lies. Well, uh, there's this video I've been curious about, so there's a certain someone I- I suspect- Oh yeah, I forgot about KG! Holy frick! Actually, when I was searching the dark, the first floor, I saw a weird video- Oh, what the frick? I'm tired of these videos. Pretty curious about Gin's actions myself. Why do you know how to get to the first floor? I don't know, he... He's a little kid, he has a big imagination. I don't, uh... Okay, now, show us this video. What's this about? Actually, this video... When I first watched it, I was too scared to look. So I used the fake Mishima monitor to play it again. What sort of video was this? Uh... Well... It's possible it's just faked, right? So I... I don't want to say anything irresponsible. I won't know unless you tell me now. Is it the one we watched together or is it a different one? Well, look. It's that video I watched with you before, Sarah. Okay. So the victim video with KG in it. Alright, Ken. What'd you find? There was a guy with glasses and something like an axe swinging in around his head. Then he said Big Sarah's name. Yeah... Sorry, dude. I don't know you. Of course, I don't res uh, suspect you or anything now. I got scared and left the room right away. But I'm sure that was a victim video. True. Okay, crap. That's all looking good for me, but I'm so happy you said it. Though, actually, maybe it was just tough for her to stay in her room because the fake Mishima AI. So, no point suspecting her. We know the reason, yeah? Is that right, Sarah? Yes. Now, and Reiko are hot, so I will not suspect them. No! That's evil! I... Is there no reason at all? Then sure, I get... <sighs> Alright, KG, what about you? I'm noticing a secret door just by searching the room of rubble. Had me tilting my head a bit. You had a... No, he has magic powers! He's a dog! You'd need a better nose than a police dog to do that. If Gin has the sense and smell of both dog and a cat, then... But we... Uh... Just a reminder, Gin's a human, guys. <laughs> Is this a j Okay. I guess we gotta- we gotta conflict her story with KG. I don't wanna do this, cause KG's really dependable, but it's pretty weird! You can't lie! Not up for debating you right now. What?! Uh, uh, God dang it. Is that not what to do? Um... Uh, let's see. Victim video. The victim video now had, had a police- Woman dying. Oh yeah, we'd use the we'd use the item instead. I guess that's fine. I don't know. Right? If now's not the time for this, I don't know when. God, I hope I don't f up. Pretty cheeky to object me, sir. What? I th oh, this is so frustrating because freaking dude, we know because of the actual gameplay elements, right? That Gin has super dog cat powers, like. Frick! I'm mad. Okay, um, what haven't I tried yet? We conflicted there and there. Maybe I show her the item? Now that is. Victim video. Yes. Please. I'm losing clout by the second. Yeah! Thank God. Okay. We got there! Now, you're talking about the victim video, aren't you? Uh, yeah, the one I dropped. Yeah, that's exactly right. Oh, God, it's a little gross. There was a woman tied up by chains. This terrifying device started up. Just like that, the woman died. There's a man in front laughing from behind. He, 
I mean, he looks like the police man. Huh. To me, it looked like he left a woman to die. Wow. A shocking story. But it, it could be a forgery, just like Kitaro. Then why don't we ask? Keiji, is that video real? Or do you deny it? I'm doubting you so we can believe you. KG, come on. There's gotta be some explanation, right? This is evil. This is the only dependable person now that we lost Joe. Like I wanna I don't even know how to protect him! Other than the argument that maybe Kitaros was I'm just gonna let him go die? I can't do that. I'm sorry, man, but I wanna know too. I want to know the truth of that video. Miss Sarah, it's looking like it'll be faster if you press the issue. <laughs> Me? I'm sure even KG will open his mouth. For his dear Miss Sarah. Expose the true colors he's kept hidden so long. I'm counting on you. <sighs> Expose KG by my own hand. Can we even do that? He's like, I don't know. Ugh! How do I? Please don't put me against him. I don't, I don't want to. No, come on, ah! Frick! I didn't want to fight you, Sarah. But well. Can't let him mislead me. I'll choose the words I can refute and talk back. Okay, we can't F up. Come on, come on. Let's discuss the victim video. No, so how about that? Yeah, 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 let's go, let's go. So I can the first trial, isn't that right? Uh, the policeman first trial, we already know it. Hard to believe I'd show up in some woman's video. Huh? Why is that hard to believe? What? Yeah, what? Why? Well, you did! With the back of your head! Can you be sure it was me? Just from that? Uh... Maybe if Mr. Policeman showed up crystal clear? That was a failure. Dang it! Our scaredy cat now able to look right at the video. Hey, shut up! I was there too! Maybe she averted her eyes in fear. If she saw it alone, I'm sure she could have made a mistake. But she didn't see it alone! Unfortunately, I also watched it with her. In the monitor room! Huh. There's no mistake, KG. It was your hair. Huh. So I see. Okay. See your friendly policeman nice and clearly. Uh, I'm not taking that bait. Can we make a back... A great call from the back view. It's no good to suspect people. I... But we kind of have to! It's you who said to suspect each other. So we trust each other, right? If only we could use concrete information. That wouldn't be suspecting. It'd be the facts. <laughs> you just laugh? Not... What is... This guy... I don't like him. He's so weird. Like what Katara said. Couldn't it be some sort of fake movie? No. So you suspect me. And turn around and believe this one. Should be no different between the two, after all. Uh... Um... Should be no difference between the two? What is- what is he saying with that? Ah, oh, thank god I have more time- I- I'm still- okay. Strange to suspect it, then turn around and believe this one. True. I can't- okay, 100% I can't pick number two. We okay, said it can't be the same- uh, I'm going with three. There isn't zero difference between them. The security camera footage had no sound. I admit, it's weak evidence, but you can't talk about them like they're identical. Yeah! We- Ah, oh, that's really shaky. I don't even believe that. Hmm. Makes some, some sense. Okie dokie, I'll admit that. Oh, th really? Okay, frick! Okay, his expression changed. Uh, there's no relation between that woman and me, is there? Mmm. Seems there is one whenever you do the first trial as a pair. Friends, sisters, students, any sort of connection? Yeah, the lady had a police woman outfit on. About that, the woman in the video was wearing a police uniform. You're a policeman too, right, KG? Isn't this just a coincidence? <laughs> I give. Wow, that was easier than I thought, Frig, okay.
Dang, Gage, you kind of suck at debating. He knows he effed up. I get. Uh, I give. I can't beat you, Sarah. Please tell us everything, KG. For once! Uh. The video's real. Jesus Christ. The victim that now saw. And it was also my first trial. The woman's name was Megumi Sashahara. She was my boss ever since I joined the force. Please. Play yes, we're getting KG backstory! Uh, I mean, it's kind of depressing, but... I'm KG Shonagi. Shin Nogi. Yeah. I've been assigned here starting this week. It's good to meet you all. Dang, she is hecka cute. Oh my god. Good to meet you. I'm Megumi Sashahara. I suppose that makes me your trainer. Well, well. Pretty impressed from, for your age, Shinogi. Uh, yes ma'am. But you might be a bit too serious. Even if you have stamina, you have to think how to spend it. Or it won't last. Yo, she's right. Uh... I heard you were rather elite, Miss... Megumi? Why would you, uh, serve as a trainer for the likes of me? <laughs> I wonder indeed. I have high hopes for you. Oh my god! Uh, yes ma'am. But then, came the day of my nightmares. What? I shot a person. A criminal in a certain case. Who was it? Miss Megumi. What? Why am I not being punished? I've... I've killed a person. In self-defense, yes. But the criminal wasn't even holding a weapon. That's... just what the law says. You've done nothing wrong. Miss Megumi. I heard you made a backroom deal. So what? What the... What the crud? Get back to your duty. You're a police. Uh, is that really what happened? <laughs> She's the benefactor who protected me. I'll never forgive it. I owed her the worst kind of debt. Left her to die. No, I... But I killed her. Megumi. <laughs> Mr. Policeman, get a hold of yourself! Holy frick, holy frick, holy frick! Sorry for que keeping quiet, everyone. <sighs> Truth is, your friendly policeman's not a policeman anymore. Kind of figured, but, uh, KG, oh my god. I'm surprised. What a dangerous individual we've had lurking in our midst. You'll vote for me. I won't complain. No. What the? Um, everybody, I am here. Hello. Also, speaking of voting, I think it's about time to decide what the? Who you vote for, and which four should enter the final vote. Uh, already? What the? No way, that's, that was way too quick. What the? Well, you need time to work out the card trace this time, you see. What? Precisely. Choosing a victim without a satisfactory discussion is not an outcome we desire, so it's not rock, paper, scissors. Yeah. Uh, what do we do? I don't want to suspect, but Kutaro, So, and Keiji, they're pretty sketchy. Hey, hold on! That, don't we need uh, one more person, though? Troubling, huh? If it's down to three options, we'll make our choices that much narrower. Gotta suspect someone again? <laughs> Maybe it's better to think of who to leave out from the final vote. <sighs> Dude, I already know what's gonna happen. It's gonna be effing Kana. Like, there's only one person to vote for. She... She had the word... <sighs> but I don't want to vote for her, because I think she... <sighs> Dang it! I can't even... <sighs> I can't protect Kana and Gen. Either you vote for Gin because everyone's going to say he's useless, or you vote for Kana because everyone's going to think he's loose. You... Can, I just, can I just vote for myself? Because no one's going to vote for me. <sighs> Whatever. Let's try that approach. 
That's a good idea, Gen. Because maybe that way I can save you and Kana. Haha. <laughs> really? Okay, frig. Uh, if you aren't chosen in the preliminary vote and are dropped out, because you can no longer be chosen, there's no need to lie to anymore, right? That might be one of our greatest allies. Of course, if you're the sacrifice, it works against you. Got it! Let's talk about who we want to leave out, Meow. Great. Yeah. Let's let's go. Oh, man. This music is so epic! Oh. I think Big Sister would be left out. Because she's super dependable. For reasoning, Wolf, it's like plot armor or something. <laughs> we should leave out someone with lots of tokens like Qtara. What? Huh? What? That don't even make any sense. If there is a chance he can still use his tokens to change the final vote around, that is... Hmm, maybe. How about we leave out Gin since he doesn't have any tokens, just a thought. I don't... I, I like Gin, he's nice to me. You shouldn't be selecting Gin or Kana. Sacrifice to the kid's no good at all. Boy, I don't... What? Huh? That's not how you started in the beginning. Oh. So she should be left out. I mean, didn't he say it was a sacrifice? True, but that could be a bluff. But I also don't feel like it is. I feel like he just got that lucky. I have to say, I'd be glad if Sarah was left out. Right. If we're leaving someone out, I think I'd say Miss Sarah, too. Okay. Well, let's go in order again, boys. Gin, hey, what up? Also, I vowed, I swore to protect Pixis Sarah. I will be your knight in Shining Meowmer. Again, that was so cringe, but so adorable. I love it. I believe in you. <laughs> You're so cute. How about we leave again out? Just listen, the best person to leave out is someone who's like, very likely to be the sacrifice. If the sacrifice comes to you, you can trade it away. If you have tokens, right? But Gen has zero tokens. True! Holy frick, now... She got beauty and brains. God dang. Hold up. Like... That's a that's an amazing point, dude. If Gin gets the sacrifice card, he's boned. If Gin had the sacrifice even once, we shouldn't he shouldn't be able to trade it. There's a high chance. So there's a high there's a higher chance he's the sacrifice. Yeah. So when, if you're using that theory, then people at the left of the the final attraction would be the most likely to have the sacrifice or keymaster cards. But that still isn't a guarantee. Yikes. So should be left out. I mean, didn't he say it was the sacrifice? It's because so is the sacrifice that he's willing to say some rotten crap. If he spots suspicious stuff and loses our trust, he can get us to vote for him. Leave him out and his heart will come, should calm down. But I, but I wonder if just leaving him out will make him say what he's really thinking? I doubt it. For an ally, he's a real pain, huh? Yeah! I... <clears throat> this sucks. A lot. We should leave out someone who has lost tokens like Qtaro. Been a bunch of card trading this time. Suppose Qtar with all his tokens was involved in at least one trade. And him giving his tokens to So. That's a, that subject could really influence the discussion. We shall leave him out to extract info. Good good point. You redeemed yourself. I, okay, I, I, I'm following your line of thinking. Kana, you. My reason... Because you're the one I want to live most, no matter what. Okay, I can't. I can't think with my feelings. I gotta think r rationally. Okay, who's the most likely candidate? I ain't trying to look like a good person. I just feel like once we lose our sensibility, but we're, we're gonna turn into demons. And I ain't gonna come to that. Then pick me, Sarah. Um. Wow, that was actually. Kinda cool, Kutaro. I he makes a good point too. Uh right, if we're leaving someone out, I think it'd be Miss Sarah. Because you're cute. What do you think I was gonna say? Not my type. Uh also I'm a boy, so I <laughs> When our escape failed, I looked at you and had a thought. She's acting kinda strange. You had this desperate look. As if you had the sacrifice. Oh my god. And on top of that, that last minute trade, right after our escape failed. Just a tad suspicious, isn't it? I was I wanna know the truth about you, Miss Sarah. 
Oh, this is tough. I don't know. I don't know. Bro. Wait, what the? I saw that. Whoa, holy crap. Holy crap. Holy crap. Last minute trade right before our escape failed. Just a tad suspicious. What the frick? What is going on with Kutaro? Kutaro, something the matter? Uh, there being a trade just before the main game. Is that true? Yeah, it's true. What about it? Uh, which means, yeah. Just maybe. I figured out who's got the sacrifice. <laughs> Meow? How could you possibly know that? You were knocked out. What? Fr from what we just... What? Kutaro. I know. Everybody, listen up! Huh? Huh? I'm the key master! Uh, uh, what? Is he serious? Yeah. I'm dan to say before voting. What's this all of a sudden? I, I can't tell where you're going with this. You would say that, huh, Sarah? Uh huh? I'm sorry for taking the key master from you. Does he... He knows. The sacrifice card you got sent was mine, Sarah. It's Kutaro who sent the sacrifice. And you still got the sacrifice now. Ain't that right? What's he talking about? I have a commoner card now. Kutaro's making a false accusation here? Is that no? He doesn't know. Think about it. If Kutaro assumed I had a commoner card and stole it and swapped me with the sacrifice, then... Doesn't that kind of make st uh, No, come on, think, think, think. There's just so much trading. If he is telling the truth, he, how would he know I have the key master unless he's the one that did it? I mean, he could just be thinking I have it again because... Ugh. Uh, stay calm, what do I do? Make use of this? No, I can't. We can't. I can't kill my... I can't kill all these people. We gotta talk it out. I absolutely don't have the sacrifice. So relax, everyone. You can vote for... Huh? Now I think about it, being thought of as the sacrifice is better than not getting votes. I'm actually not sure anymore if there's any good reason to deny- No, come- I'm sorry, Sarah, but like- I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I can't- I couldn't let them- I can't lie to them. Well, just nobody vote for Miss Sarah. That'll be fine, right? If nobody votes? Yeah, she becomes a candidate. That proves she's the sacrifice without a double vote. I would like that, but it's about time we proceed with the vote. Please wait. Can we decide on such an important vote with so much still unclear? Ugu! We just can't sort it out in such a short amount of time. God, what do we do? The victim's gonna be one of the ones we nominated, remember? We really should discuss it some more, but we don't have time. You should. Don't know when to give up, huh? Time is up. Please select the four who will remain for the final vote. Enter your votes, please. I don't know. I- I don't know. Who do I vote for? I- Kutaro- <sighs> If Kutaro has the sacrifice card and he uses it to his advantage, he'll kill us all. But we know- We know someone took the- So what card does Kutaro have now? He can't still have the sac- No, he- he has the key master! We shouldn't vote for Kutaro, dude. But if someone take the... If someone knocked him out... I can't vote for myself. But if I vote for myself and I know... I don't want to die here, dude. Come on. There's only one choice to make, dude. It's super obvious.